obesity. In the United States of America, obesity rates were 36.2%. That means for every three people, one of them is severely overweight. Now this is down to several reasons, such as the large serving sizes in America, the lack of exercise in jobs due to machinery taking over nowadays. But the biggest factor to America's severe obesity crisis is this. The most American thick burger. It's finger licking good. Now try the buffalo chicken strips. Introducing flatbread grilled chicken now at Wendy's. Fast food restaurants. In the United States of America, there's a whopping 204,000 fast food restaurants selling cheap, greasy, addictive food. But I'm just a skinny guy from England trying to gain weight. So I really want to try this food. So the other week I booked tickets to New York. And while I'm here, for the next 24 hours, I'm going to go to five of the most popular fast food chains in America and see what they're like. All right, boys, just woken up. Let's go to the first chain. Life is brief. Don't let that get you down. Don't let that get you down. It's all going to go away. Chain number one, Wendy's. This is the sixth most popular fast food place in America, turning over $9 billion a year with nearly 6,000 stores in the US and well known for its apparently fresh meals. All of Wendy's spins off one word, fresh. Let's find out. What's your most like popular meal? It has to be the 404 or the big thing. Can I get one of them, please? This is very, very famous here, so I'm excited to give it a try. I got their most famous meal, according to them, a bacon double cheeseburger, spicy nuggets, and fries. First, I tried the French fries. Good. Not bad. Yeah. Not bad. I could even go as far as saying they're better than McDonald's fries. Really? Next up was the nuggets. Well, that's spicy, bloody hell. That's good, though. And then, the big daddy, bacon double cheeseburger. Okay. That's all right. Not the best burger I've ever had. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna eat the whole meal, and then I'm gonna get the score at the end. So I absolutely devoured the meal, which had a total of 1,110 calories. Here were my thoughts. Meal devoured. Fries were absolutely beautiful. Nuggets were relatively good. Burger was a little disappointing. So if we're going purely off taste, I'd give Wendy's a 6.7 out of 10. Yeah. What's your name, by the way, mate? Apple. What, what in your opinion, is the best fast food? My job is Papa. So after the great advice from Apu, I took the long, treacherous walk from Wendy's all the way to Popeyes. This is the 20th most famous fast food place in America, turning over $3.3 billion a year, with over 2,000 1,300 stores in America. Can I get your most popular meal, please? This is the meal I got given. We've got the fries. These look extremely well seasoned, so... Very good. Wow. Better than uh, Wendy's. Better than Wendy's fries, definitely. Next, we have the chicken burger. Not the most appetising thing, but it's all about the taste. Bloody hell. That is Good. Really? That is good. Once again, I devoured the whole meal, which had a total of 950 calories. Here was my verdict. Done. That was beautiful. Initial thoughts on like the look of it and the look of the place. I thought it'd be some kind of like not great chicken burger, but the looks deceived me and it was really good. So I'm gonna give that a solid 7.6 out of 10. Fast food chain number three was Arby's. This is the 15th most popular chain in the US, generating $3.8 billion a year with over 2,100 stores in the US. And once again, I ordered the most popular meal they sold. Bloody Fuck hell. hell. What? what? This, is, this, yeah, this is America summed up. It's like half a pig. Oh, jaw clamp. <laughs> for, for one, I think it's too excessive. That is f ridiculous. But it tastes all right. I'm going to eat the entire thing, and then I'm going to give my opinion on it, because I'm not sure yet. The meal in total was 1,057 calories, which I did try to devour, but I'm going to be honest, it was the most sickly thing I've ever eaten. This sandwich is pretty disgusting. Uh, I'm like three bites in, and I already hate it. So I'm going to give Arby's a 5.6 out of 10. Chain four, Chick-fil-A. This was the most popular place I checked out. Ranked third in the US, making sales of a whopping $11 billion a year and having 2,400 restaurants. Once again, I ordered the most popular meal. I'm so excited about this one. This was a fat meal, which came to a total of 1,770 calories. I absolutely devoured the meal. And here's what I thought. Okay, I'm putting it out there. Chick-fil-A is the best fast food restaurant 
in America. Okay, I can't actually fully say that yet because I've got one more place to try. The burger was fresh, without a doubt the best burger I've had today. Nuggets, really good. Chocolate milkshake, so good. The fries were amazing. They could have been a little bit crunchier, but in total, I'm gonna give the place like a, a 9.2 out of 10. I, I really like that. We've come to the end of the day and the final fast food place we're visiting is Chipotle. Out of the entire day, this was the only place which was relatively healthy. I ordered a standard burrito and ate it at Times Square. It's like the size of my head, mate. This has got about 1,200 calories in, so crazy if you're trying to bulk. Pretty good. Chipotle wasn't the best tasting out of the rest, but I took its health factors into account and rated it 7.7 .7 out of 10, which meant that the winner was Chick-fil-A. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit the like button and maybe also consider subscribing. And lastly, if you want to get any supplements like protein powder, creatine, pre-workout, head over to my protein, which is the first link in the description. Use my code Joe at checkout, which will save you 37% off your entire order. Not only is it the cheapest way to get supplements, but it also helps me out a ton. Cheers, guys.